Now, the people of Dusi in the Talensi district of the Upper East Region are unhappy about the deplorable nature of the main road linking their area to nearby Pelungu, where most of their health complications are often referred to for treatment. They say people are losing their lives on the road and are therefore calling on the government to, as a matter of urgency, fix the road or risk losing their votes in the upcoming general elections. You see, it's a small town located in the Talensi district of the Upper East Region. The people here are mainly farmers and known generally to be a quiet, peace-loving people. In recent times, however, the deplorable nature of the roads here in Dusi has forced the people into some agitation. Of particular concern to them is the road linking their area to the Pelungu Township in the Nabdam district. The people say they commute via this road to Pelungu to do business in the market and sometimes to seek health care at the clinic there. But the road has become so bad that it is almost impossible to use it. The road is not tarred and is said to have been constructed about 30 years ago. It is now ridden with wide, deep potholes, often covered in muddy water anytime it rains. The road also becomes muddy and slippery when it rains and therefore very dangerous for commuters. Daniel Zog is the assembly member for the Ducey electoral area. Any presidential candidate or parliamentary candidate that comes out to contest the seat of Talese, the first community to visit is Ducey. They know that Ducey is a big community with about 2,000 plus population. Yet, Ducey Road is still like that, lying down. People cannot move. Market people cannot move. So we therefore want to plead with the government that the people of Ducey are fed up. We are crying because of this road. Some of the residents of Ducey have also been expressing their frustrations about the deplorable nature of this road to Joy News. One time, my pregnant daughter was in labor. We struggled so much on this road before we got her to the clinic. She nearly delivered the baby on the road. Anytime I am going to the market myself, I slip and fall several times before I make it there. Sometimes I even lose some of my goods on the way. It is as if we the people here are not even part of Ghana. And this is very frustrating. It is very sad. <laughs> When it rains, we cannot use this road. Pregnant women suffer and risk losing their babies on this dangerous road. When someone is sick and needs urgent medical attention, it is difficult for an ambulance to come through. Even a motorcycle cannot commute easily on this road with a sick person to the clinic. Therefore, we are saying that as the elections are approaching, if this road is not fixed, we do not want to see any politician coming here to campaign. All the youth here in Ducey are united on this. If our road is not fixed, we are not ready to welcome or to listen to any politician who comes here with a rally. And no one should even talk to us about going out to vote. The people of Ducey say their demonstration was meant to draw government's attention to their plight. They want the road fixed as soon as possible. For Joy News, Albert Sorry, Ducey, Talensi District.